All right, Coach, a, a tough but good win against Clemson at home. What are your thoughts about it? Um, yeah, um, very, very proud of the boys. That was a you know, great 3-1 victory. Uh, Clemson are a fantastic team, you know, high RPI team, great record, you know, high-ranking team. So we knew coming into the game it was going to be a tough, um, competitive, tight kind of a game. And it, and it was right up until we scored. It was a very even game, back and forth, bit of a midfield battle kind of thing. When we scored, it, it made them open up. I thought we looked real dangerous on the break, but they also looked fairly dangerous going forward. Uh, they tied it up 1-1, but I was so proud of the guys to have that resilience. You know, you're leading, you're doing great. They come back into it 1-1. We went up, scored 2-1, went up, scored again 3-1. So real proud of the guys. They showed that great mentality that we really preach and demand here. Yeah, we, we scored, th uh, well, three goals were scored in a matter of seven minutes after going up 1-0. Mm -hmm. uh, you think that first goal gave them some confidence to score again? I think it's just the way soccer goes. I think, you know, both teams are very tight and not happy with a tie, but both teams, you know, the tactics are working, you're limiting each other the chances. We score, it forces them to maybe go a little bit more, um, gamble a little bit more with their passes, with their personnel and starting positions. So they get in a tiny bit more. As a result, we can get in a bit more at them. And that happens in soccer a lot. You know, one goal becomes two, becomes three, whether it's you that scores them or your opponent. Um, but I was pleased the way we responded that it was us that was on the front foot. With this game being really aggressive, uh, you think that does some good for us going in conference and maybe NCAA tournament? Yes, I mean, it can't hurt. We're playing a great team with a good RPI. And, you know, the game, that they're two fantastic teams. You know, both teams didn't want to give an inch. Both teams were stood up and, and fought each other. It's a, it was a typical college night tonight. Under the lights, you know, big crowds, Clemson in town. It was one of those games where I was real proud of how we stood up and we were strong uh, against a very good opponent. So it gives us confidence. I keep saying it every, all along, whether we win or lose, we just... Talk about the game, we watch the video, we put it to bed and then we prepare for our next opponent. And um, the guys have been fantastic all year, just having their eyes on the prize, moving forward, staying in the moment, not getting carried away if it was a, a great win, not getting too high or not getting too low if it was a tough loss. We've just been staying the course and working hard this year. And, and give me your thoughts on Kyle's performance having two goals. Mm -hmm. Like I said, Kyle has been incredible from the first day he was, and obviously knowing him from club as well. He's a wonderful poised player, he's wonderful with the ball at his feet. He works his socks off. You know, he sees things quickly, little gaps that open up. And we've been really working with him and you know, getting in front of goal now. He's such a selfless player. We've been really trying to get him to be a bit more selfish and get into those good areas to score goals. And I mean, he's been doing that and more these last three or four games. He, he, you know, every time it drops to him, we know he's got good technique. So he's been doing fantastic. Um, and he, he's getting the goals that his play deserves now. All right, thanks, Coach. Thank you.